I think over the course of the period I was out, uh, expectations for rate hikes actually increased. Not not a lot, but you know, despite oil um, declining, expectations for rate hikes went up. You know, I think by about a half ha half a cut or, or sorry, a half yeah. a hike or something. So I thought <clears throat> you know those two dynamics were interesting. Okay. Yeah, uh, if you go to that's a that's an important point, Jonesy. Like if you go back to my, I'm looking at my notebook on on the fifth of July, which is of course. Uh, coming back after the long weekend, rate hike expectations were 6.93 on that chart. Yeah. This morning, it's at 7.56. So 0.6 more hikes were priced in last week, right? And bond yields are up 20 basis points on the 10-year, 27 basis points, which is where it really gets priced in on the two-year. So this is my point. The Fed, this has been our point since the beginning of the year. That's why I'm not gonna give in to your fears, your friend's fears, your dog's fears. My dog's quite fearful. Boomer has not seen me since I went to Thunder Bay. We, you know, he, well, Laura got home yesterday, had Boomer, and Boomer went to my office and didn't find me. He's fearful, <laughs> okay? So, you know, there's, I'm not gonna give in to the fears of, of fish, dogs, emotional human beings, or anything. I'm just gonna execute on the process, right? Like, so we've been saying since the beginning of really January that the Federal Reserve is going to quite literally tighten into one of the biggest quad four slowdowns of the modern era. And now they're gonna to continue to tighten into a recession. So until that changes, most things, unless signaled otherwise, don't forget that the signal would change my mind, you know, or could change my mind, should change my mind. If it doesn't, just keep doing what we've been doing, right? It's, it's, it's really straightforward. Hey there, Hedgeye Nation, or if you're not part of Hedgeye Nation, thanks for watching Hedgeye on YouTube. If you haven't already, make sure to click on the button below there, subscribe to our YouTube page. You can also follow the link in the description to our website to get even more great investing content.